Oh, okay. Okay, well. Need a hand? So this is a snake that's in question, um, it's a reticulate python, obviously this one's not as big as um, the one in the video, um, it's still a baby, I think it's just over a year old, but they will um, get up to be um, about, this one's male so probably around 15 feet, uh, female obviously bigger. Alright guys, welcome back to my YouTube again. Um, today, I'm gonna be reviewing this little clip. Um, it's it's um, this old lady um, who has a reticular python. And obviously, it's still a baby. Um, yeah, let's review this. It's mostly for Netflix people who keep on tagging me. Uh, your video man and then saying it's dangerous. It's mocky on it. It's never the animal or fault. It's uh, we as a human being or let's say like animal or understand what a character or case and then what they're doing at the moment. The characteristic 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 or pornu like you need to sort of affe make the decision based on um, how they're feeling at the moment. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, let's go on ahead with the video. Okay, first thing already, which, um, uh, full disclosure, I've already seen this video that I'm just gonna go through again. Um, first thing, my Norman Prager is like case. Um, much personally, I prefer cases where it's a side word in the skin, like instead of like top button in the skin on that side in the skin, because like, um, naturally, snakes are corporator, or let's say, um, attack guard that they always because snakes are low on the ground, and so they always mathy but down, so, so they tend to get all get paranoid, not paranoid, like scared. Um, uh, and they, yeah, so anything coming from above, let's go like, like, um, is it, was it, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, what's the word, like, Jaskin, sir? Yeah, uh, basically they don't like things that's coming from the top to grab them because that usually means um, predator or uh, predator, natural prey or ne, uh, smaller snakes or the natural prey or um, more or less bird of prey or um, obviously top but on it. Yeah, but it's personal preference. It doesn't really matter if you do the right thing with your lady like or China who training, but me personally I prefer side and skinny because that means. Unarke level mount sa me and then they they feel less scared. Scared. Um Okay, on with the video. I keep on looking this way because like my setup match yeah video sorry so <laughs> the phone time I was telling you about, we're gonna speak up Chris does is really was the best thing that we can do. Okay, sorry guys, I don't know if video audio cost us, huh? But we'll see. Okay, okay, it's open, but it's all retake. Oh, see, here's the thing. Okay, pause. Here's the thing. Like, the retake is already, like, mathy and not through this ago. It, it means, like, it knows something is coming right now. Um, you know what? Let's, let's just go ahead and I'll explain it a bit further. I don't think it's all right. You gonna come out? Okay. Oh. Problem. Case right now, uh, Sarpar, like modes, like mode or uh, mode like uh, just mode man. So, so they're either like hunting mode, feeding mode, um, like defensive mode. That's a, that's a mode man. So Sarpar, like say reptiles are like because um, they don't really have emotions. Um, you have to think of unarko emotions, uh, like Hamle portray on emotions into like modes or okay? defensive modes on it. Like they don't want uh, they don't want anything to do with you. Feeding mode on it. like can go matter doesn't matter. Um, any hunting mode on it. this right here. Um, target fixation on it. Case only with the case. 
that's how they normally hunt in the wild anyway. Target fix or so, and then they go in for a strike. So yeah, like, problems kill when the kid like is open gonna be the the snake thinks it's feeding time and then he like hunting mode my guy. Uh, hunting mode slash feeding mode my guy. And then he kids call it Japa kids what our eye boss it means like Sorpo is about to strike on like to say target fixtures and got go like our target cut us on X in here, Sonny. Um I'll explain it further as video goes. On another thing which uh I Manchala Bedego Mansala the Mansu Sorpa long tongue flicks on it could say it's usually not a good sign. Um yeah I'm a tongue flicker. I said, um, the sense and a sort of flicker since Sarpale as a tech got it like bitter lane. So it's usually just like exploring the environment. So it's just trying to figure out, um, kick it like center, kick it, ho, the kick. It's just exploring those like short tongue flicks. I ruin it. say, um, explore matter got it go. Jawa, you know, the zebra lamb can I flick up and down or so. That means you need to be a bit wary. Uh, normally, though, when I can say um, they're stressed, um, and then he, they're in a defensive mode. Yeah. Uh, but over, in this situation, say um, I'm guessing it's still in hunting mode. So it's trying to figure out um, food hookie night type go. Uh, and yeah, long tongue flicks is usually a big no no sign. You don't want to mess around like that. It's normally say in my experience say they're in defensive mode. So like long tongue flick usually means don't touch me. <laughs> Man, this lady here. Um those of you who came to Mirror Reptile Room or Malisani Nani or Zugdad Mo always I always use hook that's a hook training one so, so basically uh remember feeding mode uh unar feeding mode ma son say hook le nakma esari type gare hunche and then like head back one say unar go feeding response break gare ga okay? so the break gare hunche they know eh it's not feeding time on it cuz usually kids khole bitike they think it's feeding time that are like hook training le gare nose ma type gare ra back log yo hunche it's usually um them realizing it's not food, so I'll get relaxed and so less tense. Um, always hook train, man. Even like, but sunny, but I still hook train it. It's it's just for your own safety, so like stuff like this doesn't happen. And continue. Okay, well, need a hand? No, I'm gonna have Okay, another thing, do you want Um, sorry, oh, you daddy, so they do you want to say, you want to uh, Tulo Sarpar, Sangha Salon Daddy, situation like this in Daddy. Um, it, video quality isn't that good, but I think stock shed open, so you may do the other day, no matter. Okay, Sarpar on coil gonna. The tiger, I will I'll some of Sarpa live with oh, sh oh is that what I think it is? Okay, another thing my uh pila video my notice got in that um I think the they got um Musa Rakne Rak or Pani Musa breed gun rack or pony same Toma which is excellent. let me see if that's actually a rodent rack. Nope. Yep. It is definitely a rodent rack. So um that's kind of stupid. You don't. Okay. Um. Rodan rack on it. Because abo like two little breeders are. It's after rat or breed got to a daddy. They put. Um. That's the system of doing it. It's, it's a lot easier for them. Um. <clears throat> okay. Uh, all the thing more personal. I would never put like Musaru in the same place where the Sarpa is because like think about this. Um, Sarpa is in one side, Musa is in Argo side. Sarpa can always like smell Musa, and then he, that usually means Sarpa is always in like oh Kanukura, Kanukura, Kanukura because it can always smell food. Um, I'm not sure why they would do that because that's kind of stupid. Kinanito one, it's a more or less Sarpa agi mode on it. If it can smell prey, it will always be in like hunting mode. Um, I don't know, it's so stupid, like same time I I would like imagine you're a snake well obviously human works so we can 
I'll get to think a bit more than reptiles that are like pretend like um pretend like hamro um thinking they like snake theory so it's literally just like survive uh get food uh, anywhere opportunistic feeder or unargo feeding schedule or there's never like a time so whenever they can get food unarli did hero food kanza um and mate and reproduce and that's it um imagine you're smelling constantly food underneath timro like timro instinct ne timro natural instinct is to like uh since you're an opportunistic feeder you go for the food get underneath like imagine you can smell food 24/7 that would always keep you in hunting mode um I don't know it's so stupid I I I I genuinely don't understand like musaru same thing but I have to sort out that it's anyway let's go ahead with the video so, this is why you have two people okay see says um, it as well due to mancy signs this is why you have two people on it I think stock shed or but I'll get there I got distracted by the road and rat okay her rat like isn't as is so get the snake hook and see if you can get it Like her, oh, don't pull it don't like that. Okay, like kid, level one. Yeah. Um, okay, yeah. This orca thing. Um, <coughs> snake orca fangs are just that are just. Um, masako who can say it's the halco, like it's the type co. That's the one. Okay, so like if a snake, let's say this is my hand. I know. What's the example? Okay, this is my hand. Snake orca fang is to, and if it bites you like that, you don't want to pull it like that. Kid, I need to go and say like, "Timarco masu or rip punza." So what you want to do is like. Snake lesser talks up. What you want to do is like, I'll get the push in gunne, lose an up gunne. This was the ball up, pull back gunne. Okay. So it's basically like fish hook. The kid he said not to do it, but the kid I it doesn't look like he's either panicking or like um, he's all get the on experience because the kid like the way he's saying stuff, he does like experience. Make your experience also. So since I saw, he might have just made a mistake. Your video, man. No, no, honey, I need to get underneath her, her finger, her, her, her no. teeth. Yes. Yeah. Oh, so that can be done. One, isn't it? So basically, what she's trying to do is like, is there or get so to hook? Let's say, um, I mean, or cut off. I know it's easy to explain. No. So basically, imagine you're just so. I mean, it's hard to see. Like, so hook. Let's say, is there sliding or there to that? Just gonna try go there. So then pull the hand out. Gonna collide. Honey. Here we go. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Okay. That's out. So. Okay, orca thing like I know there's a lot of blood and like, cause the um. Like um, can't even know the exact but snake bites generally aren't that. I mean, it, obviously there's a lot of blood, but it's usually like flesh wound or matter. It's not like they don't really do major damages. Um. Uh, Just a flesh wound. This is but a flesh wound. Kick it on, Zinni. They are. Um, obviously, you're gonna be bleeding a lot because remember, when our when our fangs are, it's it's very sharp, like needles of stone. So, so imagine there's like I wonder what kind of fangs. I don't even know. They did it. Imagine all this needle going in and like ripping it off. It's personally say oh talking about bites i want to i want to let me finish this off real quick on this which um i'm going to talk about bites as well okay. um let's get um, let's stop good. filming and help okay saki so, ale yeah, well um okay cover us things uh the lady did good obviously um It sounded like she knew what she was doing like instruction or did i think can i talk get a panic or but uh, whatever um She was calm. She didn't panic because, like, panic got her pulled out of the situation. Have been like could have been. Re- mm, sorry, mm. Mm. the situation could have been really bad. Um, I mean, I still don't understand because she sounds very like uh, she knows what she's doing type co. Only I still don't understand why like there was signs already. Um, case calling with the target fixation. There was a long term flicks. And this was he like you had run case in like your snake room, uh, but um, well, I mean, still, hopefully, she learned a lesson. I would never do that. But um, anyway, I was talking about bites. So um, sorry, but let's talk that. See, there's two times, two types of bites. Um, erote what we call defensive strike, uh, and arcote um. 
kere well accidental your la- lady love okay accidental um feeding response strike um so defensive strike is the least painful one out of those two you know defensive strike one they go say they don't want to be moved they don't want to be touched uh remember none of them are aggressive fights it's always defensive or accidental strikes remember that yeah guys koi snake let's go ahead maza yo human like token for you and they talk the nakai unless if you provoke them obviously they're going to fight back <laughs> okay that's another topic of uh, uh, leave it um strike so two types of strikes defensive and then accidental feeding rest one strike defensive strike is the less least painful one kind of defensive strike and it they just don't want to be moved or touched or anything and you put your hand in talk maybe to get they let go and they go back to their position to one say don't come close to me i can bite you more on it or like warning just the hair okay um that's that's the least painful one out of orco one out of which your lady love okay which is accidental or like feeding strike to one say when they're when they accidentally confuses your hand or something for like food cat to one because una ru talks up talk and they don't let go talk ne bitike they coil around thinking it's food but once they know um uh, your food or not this what she said they let go and then he, yeah so second one boy your lady like say thinking it was food um and yeah that is it um anything else anything else um uh like i said sarpo ko situation i think lady should have um this lady should have like oligati read the situation oligati for the snake i'll get better so it didn't i don't know if it was just because like there was a video recording or and she felt oligati video ga lai huncha ni obviously video record bhayira cha ni kala cha alika so off gona lagdena um could be that or she genuinely made a mistake which can happen obviously it's called a mistake for a reason it's called an accident for a reason because well it's an accident there yeah, are normally snakes are like this if you know how to um read their body not body uh, body language when i guess cuz like tongue flick target fixation everything um and always hook train if you got a big snake two people hook train always cuz accident can happen your little lab boy yeah? and um yeah that's it guys um thank you for watching hopefully this so of alkadi cleared out um manche alai alkadi so of like sarpa let that manche khansa that's the stuff for you obviously this was an accident um can happen to anyone mm-hmm. usually doesn't happen if you do the right way and um obviously um i don't know um any questions you know mirror ig or they're all in the descriptions and um Mm-hmm. That's it for the video guys. Thank you very much for watching and I will like share and subscribe and I will see you next time. Peace.